guys, it's Ben and Bev. Today we're gonna try some chips from around the world. And some of the ones we got here, we got one from Taiwan that is spicy Korean pork flavored, as well as three wavy flavors of Lay's from India, including India's tikka masala. Spanish tomato tango and chili lemon. Let's give it a go. All right, so first one we're decided to do is the Korea spicy pork. They're the only ones that aren't wavy, so. Smells like pork. It's actually not a super great smell, to be honest. No. So, it smells a little dog treaty, which yeah. means it probably <laughs> tastes good. But uh, yeah, it's kind of like the Euro flavor that they had a few years ago with the Lay's Pick Your Flavor thing. Mm -hmm. Kind of reminded me of that smell a bit. And as you can see, they look almost like regular potato chips. So, here you go. Pork. Mmm. Ooh. Oh, that's good. You can even taste like the, the fire grilled skin. Yeah. On the outside, tastes like they spent some time in a grill. Like pork. <laughs> Actually, that's really good. And the spice is kind of mild. You do get the sweetness of the gochujang paste, but it mm -hmm. mainly just like a slight lingering spice gets hotter the more you eat. But the addictive quality of these, and if I remember correctly, ingredient number four is MSG. So yeah. <laughs> so yes, it is very addictive. Mm. Very good. Mm. It kind of has it fatty smokiness the bacon has as well. Oh, it's good. Yeah, these are really good. These are gonna be uh, hard to beat. Mm -hmm. Already on my list, actually, of favorite foreign chip flavors I've had. All right, the next chip is the India Lay's. First one, India's Magic Masala. It says better mix of spices right there with the chili peppers and garlic. Pretty excited for these. Doing these ones first because the bag is a little just deflated because I let them sit too long, so. Hopefully, everything is good. Just like the chip curries, you got it open. Oh, okay. All right. I'm gonna grab one. And, uh, it's not really good. It's not very chickeny. A little bit of that chicken ramen packet type of thing. And they are wavy, wavy, yeah. wavy, and red too. So it's good to go. Hmm. Mm, they're good. I do taste the cilantro and the garlic a lot. And the, there's like the chili bite kind of on the sides here, time. Mm -hmm. I'm sure they actually have a lot more flavor than the last one we tried, but it's kind of that like chili, spicy chip tip chase that you get over here. They definitely have a different texture. Mm hmm Yeah, they're like a thicker chip too. Yeah. The mm. They're good. Yeah, those are tasty. Awesome. Yeah, on to the next one. Spicy. Now on to the third chip, Spanish Tomato Tango. It says it is the juiciest tomato flavor they have. Let's see if you can open these easier than me. <laughs> I'm guessing with the snacks <laughs> from India, the reason we're having this is because they have the. I'm just gonna do that. Oh, that's fair <laughs> enough. Just tip it open. It smells like ketchup. It smells identical to ketchup. I made a weird <laughs> face because it's acidic like ketchup is too. And red just like the other one. Wavy. Um, yeah. It smells exactly like ketchup. It's really tangy. Yeah. It does smell tangy. I'm curious. <laughs> it, uh... Ketchup into McDonald's sweet... McDonald's fries. With ketchup. She doesn't like uh, potatoes very much, so that's not a good comparison for her. I think it kind of tastes like tomato basil soup a little bit too. Magoosh. No, it does not taste like soup. It tastes it's very like tangy though. McDonald's fries dipped in ketchup. Not the comparison I was expecting <laughs> to be made, but okay. All right. 
Those ones probably aren't going to go down as their favorite for the day. No. I don't really like tomato either. I think they're pretty good. <laughs> but I like ketchup. Not fries. On to the next one. <laughs> now on to the last but not least, chili lemon flavor. Which I've had a couple times from Lay's, but never from another country. Or is a wavy, so really? double excited. Bad open. The package battle. Okay, we're looking again. Mm -hmm. They had a yeah, spot for a bit too. Biodegradable chip bags over there. So. They smell a little lemon. It's interesting. It also smell. smells like it smells like the chili lime and uh, the ramen, the ramen version of that that they have over here. Wavy and red. Yeah, all of them have actually looked almost identical with yeah. Indian ones. <laughs> Tasted completely different so far. But... Mm. Very limey. Very limey. I don't want to even chew it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Interesting. Second chip. A little bit of spice on the tongue. Yeah. And in the back of the throat, but it's mainly just a sweet lime flavor. But once again, probably times 10 what I've actually had chili lime flavor wise. Besides Takis, they're not as intense as Takis, but they are. They do have a little spice, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So I think my favorite for the day is probably going to be the spicy pork one. Same. Yeah. That one was so good. I didn't realize that you can make a chip taste that much like real meat. And it was <laughs> disturbing in some ways, but amazing in others. Um, I do like all of the Indian ones, actually. I think probably, actually, the tikka masala is probably my favorite. Because even though it didn't taste quite like what it was supposed to, it had a uh, flavor I enjoyed. Have a great day, guys. Yep. See you next time. Like, comment, subscribe.